Bus drivers do all they can to keep kids safe while taking them to and from school, but they need your help as well. According to the Department of Education, there were 377 crashes in Virginia involving school buses during the 2014-15 school year. We would like to caution all motors that with the end of summer, it is the beginning of the school year, and with that time of year, we would like to caution all motors to be on the lookout for school buses, particularly in the morning hours and in the early afternoon hours. Also pay particular attention to your school zones. If the lights are flashing, it is an active school zone. You must abide by the speed limit for that particular school zone. Um, penalties of speeding in the school zone or passing a stopped school bus are significant in the state of Virginia. You can be charged with reckless driving. Uh, it is not something to be taken lightly. This is our children's lives in our hands. We have to pay particular attention, make sure we keep them safe as well as everybody else on the highways. State law requires you to stop when a school bus is loading and unloading, even if signals are not working properly. Divided highways are the most confusing for drivers. The law is very clear on when to stop for a stopped school bus. If it is a divided highway, you do not have to stop, but by divided, there means there is a positive median barrier, such as a, um, a guardrail or some type of um, shrubbery or trees. A undivided highway is there is no, there is no division between the lanes. There is a um, center turn lane such as in our area in Collinsville, Virginia. That is not a divided highway. That is just a, it's an undivided highway. So if, there, if you are headed northbound and a school is stopped on the southbound side, you must stop because there is no division between the roadways. Um, of course, on a two-lane highway, if the school bus is stopped and the stop sign is flashing and the lights are flashing on the bus, you must stop. Uh, but a lot of people get confused on when to stop and when not to stop if the highway is divided or not divided. Um, and we want to provide some clarity on that because we want to keep uh, children safe when they're loading and unloading from the school bus. Let's keep our kids safe. In Collinsville, I'm Rodney Billings for BTW 21 News. If you're looking for the best selection of trucks and SUVs in the area at a price that cannot be beat, then log on to AutosByNelson.com and search our entire inventory right from your own home. We have the names you want. Ford, Mazda, Chevy, Subaru, Toyota, Honda, and more. All makes, all models from every lot. Competitively priced and ready to move. Search our entire inventory right from your mobile device. You can even schedule a service appointment or apply for financing, all at AutosByNelson.com.